Scientists with the European Space Agency are celebrating a historic feat. For the very first time, a spacecraft landed on a speeding comet. Marcy Gonzalez has more on what, what's next for the Rosetta spacecraft. What may sound like science fiction is now science reality. A spacecraft landing on a comet for the first time ever. We definitely confirmed that the lander is on the surface. We are sitting on the surface. Fila is talking to us. More data to come. And we are on the comet. Since blasting into space in 2004, the European Space Agency's Rosetta spacecraft has been slingshotting around the solar system to catch up with Comet 67P. It is as old as the solar system, and scientists believe it may hold answers to some of our planet's biggest mysteries. If life really emerged on Earth, or if it might have been brought to Earth via such comets many billion years in the past. To collect data that will hopefully unlock those secrets, this morning Rosetta launched a small lander called called Philae. It's roughly the size of a washing machine and managed to land on the comet, which is just about two and a half miles wide and is speeding at nearly 84,000 miles per hour. The spacecraft is very healthy and we have had just right now a go from the flight control team. Already picking up this unexplained noise from the comet and sending back what's being described as comet selfies. And Philae is already transmitting information from the surface of that comet. Scientists calling today's success a, quote, big step for human civilization. Marcy Gonzalez, ABC 7 News.